Have you ever wondered why narcissists seem to have an uncanny ability to lie, even when the truth is glaringly obvious? Let's delve into this perplexing behavior. You see, when narcissists lie, they're not just spinning tales to deceive you. No, they're engaging in a calculated power play, a strategic maneuver to assert their dominance and superiority. Imagine a chessboard. Each lie they tell is a calculated move, a pawn advancing, a queen cornering the king. It's all a game of power to them, and they're playing to win. They manipulate the narrative, bending and twisting it to suit their needs, to make them the victor. In their alternate reality, they're always right, always the victim, always the hero. They're the puppet master, pulling the strings, constructing a world where they reign supreme. And you? You're left questioning your judgment, feeling disoriented and powerless, caught in their web of deceit. Their lies serve a dual purpose. Not only do they assert their superiority, but they also maintain their power over others. They're in control of the narrative and they want to keep it that way. But what about the truth? Well, for a narcissist, the truth is a malleable entity, something to be molded and shaped to fit their agenda. It's not about honesty or integrity, it's about control and superiority. So, what can you do? Firstly, be aware of this tactic. Recognize it for what it is, a power play. Don't let their lies make you doubt your reality. Trust your instincts and stand firm. And remember, it's not about you. It's about their need to feel superior and in control. Remember, when a narcissist lies, they're not just deceiving you, they're attempting to control the narrative and assert their dominance. What if I told you that narcissists are often terrified of criticism? Yes, it's true. Their grandiose exterior hides a delicate ego, constantly threatened by the possibility of critique. This fear of criticism often triggers their propensity to lie, as they use deceit as a shield to protect their fragile self-image. Consider it like this. Narcissists are architects of their own reality. They construct elaborate narratives, meticulously designed to paint them in the most favorable light possible. They are the heroes, the victims, the misunderstood geniuses in their own stories. And in these alternate realities, there is no room for critique or judgment. But why do they do this? Well, it's simple. Narcissists are afraid of being exposed. They dread the thought of their true character being revealed, their flaws being laid bare for the world to see. So, they lie. They manipulate. They weave complex webs of deception to hide their imperfections and present a flawless facade to the world. You might catch them red-handed, but don't expect them to admit their wrongdoings. They'll deny it, twist the facts and perhaps even turn the tables on you. This isn't about accepting responsibility for their actions. This is about survival, their survival. It's a desperate attempt to protect their self-image at all costs. And remember, narcissists are masters at manipulation. They have an uncanny ability to distort reality, to bend the truth until it aligns with their narrative. They can make you question your own judgment, make you doubt your own reality. But don't let them. When dealing with a narcissist, it's crucial to stay grounded in your truth. Don't let their fear of criticism and subsequent lies sway you. Trust your instincts. Trust your judgment. Remember, you have the power to see through their deceit and stand firm in your reality. So when you encounter a narcissist, be aware of their fear of criticism. Understand that their lies are merely a desperate attempt to protect their fragile ego. And most importantly, trust yourself. You are stronger than their lies, stronger than their manipulation, you have the power to stand firm in your truth. Despite their bold facade, many narcissists harbor a deep fear of rejection. But how does this fear manifest in their behavior? In truth, beneath the seemingly unshakable confidence and self-assured demeanor, many narcissists are plagued by the terrifying thought of rejection. This fear is so intense that it drives them to spin tales and create a false narrative to protect themselves from the possibility of abandonment. You see, narcissists aren't just afraid of being alone, they're terrified of being exposed. They dread the thought of someone seeing through their act, recognizing their true character, and deciding to leave. This fear is a powerful motivator, compelling them to construct an illusion of perfection. It's like they're performing in a play with a script they've written themselves, a script where they're always flawless, always admirable, and always deserving of admiration. By creating this illusion of perfection, 
They hope to keep you hooked, to keep you from seeing the truth and ultimately from leaving them. But here's the thing. This entire charade is not really about you. It's not about preserving a relationship built on trust, respect or genuine affection. No, for a narcissist, it's all about their ego, their need to feel superior and in control. They use lies and deception as a shield, a defense mechanism to protect their fragile self-image. Their fear of rejection is so intense that they'd rather live in a web of lies than face the harsh reality of their imperfections. In their quest to avoid rejection, they manipulate, deceive and distort reality, all to maintain the illusion of perfection. But remember, no one is perfect. We all have flaws and that's okay. It's part of being human. So when dealing with a narcissist, it's crucial to remember their tactics. Don't let their fear-driven lies make you question your reality. Don't let them manipulate you into believing their illusion of perfection. It's not about preserving a relationship for a narcissist. It's about securing their ego, maintaining control and avoiding rejection at all costs. Did you know narcissists often believe they're above the rules? This belief often fuels their lying behavior. While you're striving for honesty and fairness, narcissists are playing a different game entirely. They're driven by a sense of entitlement that convinces them they're exempt from the standards and norms that apply to others. This inflated sense of self-importance leads them to bend the truth without a second thought. They believe they're entitled to get what they want, when they want it, and by any means necessary. And yes, this includes lying about infidelity. It's not about you or the relationship, but about their entitlement and refusal to be bound by norms. When confronted with their lies, they might dismiss your feelings, even denying the undeniable. But remember, you must stand your ground. Don't let their sense of entitlement erode your self-worth. When caught, they might dismiss your feelings, denying the undeniable. Stand your ground and not let their sense of entitlement erode your self-worth. Admitting to infidelity would mean losing control of the situation, something that narcissists greatly fear. Imagine holding on to the reins of power so tightly that the mere thought of loosening your grip sends shivers down your spine. That's the reality for narcissists when faced with the prospect of admitting infidelity. It's not just about the act itself, it's about the domino effect that could ensue. The carefully constructed persona they've spent years, perhaps decades building could come crashing down. Their narrative, the one where they're the hero, the victim or the misunderstood genius, is threatened. And that's a risk they're not willing to take. So they lie, they deny, they deflect. Not necessarily because they believe their own lies, but because they fear the loss of control that comes with the truth. Remember, for a narcissist, control is everything. Their fear of losing this control can drive them to lie, even when the truth is undeniable.